negotiations at home, mm -hmm. negotiations with your partner, with your neighbor, with your children. What are the main rules of a negotiation to succeed in these kind of environments, which often can be even more difficult, right, than in mm -hmm. business, because you're negotiating with people that you care about? Um, especially in private negotiation, start as early as possible. So if you do have the feeling something is wrong, say talk it. About it. Uh, mm. Talk about it. Talk about it. Uh, because if you wait, then you start to negotiate with yourself. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and yeah. then it's getting more more complicated. Mm. So if something is wrong, or well, wrong, if you think something is speak should up. be changed, speak up. Say it. Yeah? That's number one. Uh, always start with thank you. Thank you for this opportunity. Thank you for expressing your concerns. Thank you for letting me know. Mm. Um, thank you is the, the best way to show respect in the negotiation. Yeah. And it works perfectly well with the kids as well. Exactly. We underestimate it. Yeah. But thank you for sharing that with me to a four-year-old. It yeah. really makes an impact. Yeah, it really makes an impact. And as a fa father of four kids, um, they learn it and they, they learn from you. Yeah. yeah. And then they start a negotiation with, thank you, Daddy, for this opportunity. And then ah. you know, <laughs> <laughs> So thank you. And the third one is we always start with common interests, mm -hmm. not with the conflict. Yeah. So we are here because we want, we are in the same situation. We want to, to reach a target, we want to reach a, an agreement, whatever. So always we talk about the common interest before we, before we come up with the framework. 